let's move to the first topic that is what is personal selling personal selling as the name says means selling personally that is involving a face to face interaction between the seller and the buyer for the purpose of sale this does not mean getting the prospects to desire what the seller wants but the concept of personal selling is also based on customer satisfaction having said that let's understand its key features well the first and the most important feature of personal selling is that there is a personal interaction between the buyer and the seller they have a face to face and direct communication and contact between the two because of this obviously there is a two way communication which is a second feature of personal selling two way communication in the sense not only the seller can communicate to the buyer about the product and the brand and its features and usages but also can get a feedback in return from the buyer with regards to the advantages of the product or the disadvantages or any complaint or any feedback with regards to the improvisations these are the exactly two features which are missing in our other techniques that is advertisement specially and sales promotion next one is the feature of personal selling is better response since the buyer and seller in direct face to face contact with each other there is always a better response from the point of the buyer because the buyer can communicate directly with the seller put across its problems and its questions and hence which can be immediately even be addressed by the seller without any time gap or lag in between hence the customer will always feel way more important and will feel that he is being an important part of the entire company's affairs next being better relationships yet again since there is a direct communication and contact between the buyer and seller and a two way communication it leads to formation of better and strong relationship between the buyer and seller which becomes very handy in the resales and in building customer loyalty and finally better convincing since the salesman or the seller is in direct contact with the buyer he can always play a way more important role in influencing motivating and persuading the buyer to buy the product and hence become way more convincing than other promotional techniques